Hi, my name is Dovli Tichever uh, and I am a professional uh, AC technician from Israel and today I want to show you how to replace, how to check and replace if there is a need a uh, thermistor in an AC unit. Uh, we are talking about a wall mounted split system and uh, let's check it out. So first thing we need to do is to shut down the electricity. Now we need to remove the plastic cover that covers the inside coil. We will need to remove the air filters out of the unit. There are few types of thermistors, not all the thermistors are the same. Uh, in our case, the thermistor uh, needs to show 10K, it's 10 kilo ohms under 77 uh, degree uh, environment. And that, that means that if the temperature uh, is 77 degree Fahrenheit, uh, if the thermistor is not faulty, he will show us 10 kilo ohms when we will check it with multimeter. And uh, if in your case you will be checking it and it will show you 1 kilo ohm or 2 kilo ohms, uh, that means that the thermistor is faulty and you need to replace it. Uh, so let's see how we reach the thermistor area and we check the thermistor and if it is uh, faulty we will replace it. In the right side of the unit you will see the thermistors. There are two thermistors in this unit. One thermistor is an air thermistor and the second one is coil thermistor. Both of the thermistors are connected to the main control unit. The control unit controls all the systems in the air conditioner. And the, the role of the thermistor is to indicate to the control unit the current temperature. So as you can see this is a coil thermistor, we need to remove it out of his housing in order to replace it with a new one. Now when the thermistor is in its place, we will have to put his plug to the place where he belongs. Now we will remove the air thermistor also in order to check his resistance.
the resistance is 9 kilo ohms and because it is hot in the room this is a good value i will show you how to replace this thermistor anyway just to show you how it's being done we need to remove the thermistor from his housing also and replace it with a new one Now let's put this thermistor also in its place in the main control unit. Now we need to close back all the covers that we removed. Don't forget to return this plastic, it controls the air direction in the AC unit. Let's return the air filters back to their place. So if in your case you find the thermistor uh, faulty and you need to replace it, there is a link beneath this video in the description area. This link uh, addresses you to Amazon where you can uh, buy uh, the thermistor that will be suitable to your unit. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Take care. Bye bye.